Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Julie, how about we start with you? Okay, so I have this article here that's from Grantland, and um, it's about the concept of the manic pixie dream boy. The part that I'm like a little bit fascinated bit with is that she talks about One Direction, the oh. boy band, and she talks about their new song, which is like, it's called Little Things, and <laughs> which, <laughs> right. So it's like, the little crinkles in your eyes when you smile, your stomach and your thighs. And then this is where it gets really like weird, creepy, like I wanna like wear your skin like a coat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He goes, the dimples in your back at the bottom of your spine, how much you weigh, <laughs> and that you still have to <laughs> squeeze into your jeans. I was just totally floored by the idea that there would be a boy band who would be talking about girls' butt fat. I'm just recalling the fact that there was a news item about um, One Direction and how they might have gotten an STD from chlamydia from a koala. I mean, they're also British, which makes them like tenfold weirder than sorry, but they like British yeah. dudes. Yeah, they, they do like they do like some butt. Yeah, I'm just saying that I'm gonna go listen to that song as soon as we're done. Okay, interesting. Okay. Perfect. All right, what about you, Jessica? What did you get a chance to write about well, this week? Well, I wanted to write about um, Joe Von Belcher, okay. who is the football player that murdered his girlfriend and committed suicide over the weekend. Mm -hmm. And Sad. it's, of course, such a tragic, horrible story. And so some people have been saying maybe it's because he was a football player and he had brain trauma. The the thing that's sad about all this is that he killed his girlfriend and himself. And we're talking about you know, brain trauma might be the reason that he did this, not domestic violence. Or... I get the sort of it, the desire to figure out what happened because there doesn't seem to be a lot of sort of signs pointing to like this had been the last in a like a string of incidents. Yeah, it's not adding up. Like I think people, yeah, I think people probably are searching for answers because you, something like that doesn't just ha you know happen out of the blue. But I also think I see what your your point is that whatever you know whatever role um, brain trauma may have played in this incident, it doesn't excuse what happens. Right. Whenever something horrible like this happens, like it is an opportunity to talk about like the larger issues and so mm. both of those being domestic violence mm. and gun control and what have you. And and Sports, football being yeah. uh, the most <laughs> savage sport ever. And mm. why do we love it so much? Sorry um, to be a downer, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Amy? Um, well, mine is a little more funny, I hope. Um, <laughs> so last night I was hanging out with a friend and uh, have you guys all heard of the slow sex movement? This friend of mine last night was talking about, she brought up slow sex, and I was like, Hoo. and then she yeah. brought up how there's, her friend went to a sex workshop, and there was this exercise that you're supposed to do with your partner, where you like lie in spread eagle, butterfly position, and your partner is supposed to look at your vagina for a full 15 minutes, 15 minutes, and just report what he sees. Well, I can't stare at anything yeah. for 15 minutes. I can't minutes. stare at the Mona Lisa for 15 minutes, let alone <laughs> yeah. somebody's yeah. vagina. I, I feel there was an article by that dude, Justin Rocket Silverman, oh, yeah. in the Post, like oh, five years, four or five years ago. Right. That was like all about that, and it was like, oh. and you're, and then he's like massaging her ah. and like bringing her to orgasm, like with other people in the room. Like, I wonder if I'm gonna ask my favorite porn it? star, oh, Manuel oh, yeah. Ferrara, yeah. if he. Would ever stare at a vagina for 15 minutes. What is the girl supposed to do the whole time? Just lie Can you read there. a book? Do I don't kegels. Know. She does kegels. All right, that was fun. Thanks, Hi. guys. It was great. Hi. If you would like to comment on these stories, or if uh, you've ever had sex with the white spirit, or if you <laughs> would stare at a vagina for 15 minutes, please tell us uh, and leave your comments in our comment section. And we will see you next week. Bye. Bye.